Well, Rudy, that iconic movie is the inspiring story of the little guy finishing first. A true story of an aspiring football player who made his dream come true at Notre Dame. Everybody told me that being a Notre Dame football player would be impossible. You're five feet and up, a hundred and up. You don't give up, do you? You ready, champ? I've been ready for this my whole life. That movie released more than 30 years ago based on the real story of Joliet native Rudy Rudiger. And Rudy joins us now. Thanks for being with us. No, it's no, this is exciting. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Joliet Living native being on Vegas. WGN, I can see, you know, sure. in your whole life story, this has to be a very big deal. Um, no, you're, you're perhaps, to me, it is. Yeah, yeah, well, we're happy to have you, Rudy. Uh, you're perhaps best known for what happened in the final 30 seconds of that Notre Dame game, but what is it that you want people to take away from, from your talk tonight and really the books and talks that you do all over yeah, the country? of course. Uh, hope. Uh, they have to have a dream. Uh, hope is very important in your life. If you have hope, it gives you a purpose. And that's what the movie was about. Uh, having that dream, it's never too late. And the journey is the deal. Uh, it's not the football moment. Uh, it's getting in Notre Dame academically and in the football. But it's about the journey you had to take in order to get there and the steps you had to take. And that, most people will say, well, maybe it's not for me. But if you have the true feeling of what you want in life, it is for you the hard work yeah. and work ethic. It's a good message. Mm -hmm. You know, we were talking about how this movie was released 30 years ago. Yes, it seems, yeah, it seems like yesterday, but it's been 30 years now. And I'm wondering, <laughs> uh, now when people meet you and they get a chance to talk to you, what is that exchange like? Do they, you know, obviously remember the movie? What yeah, do they tell you yeah. nowadays? Well, you know, they get very emotional. Uh, one, when I meet people, because it meant something to them. And you never know who's going to come up to you and say what that movie has done for them. Uh, I remember I was at an LA Laker game uh, watching the late Kobe Bryant play, and, and he came up to me and told me how the movie inspired him to work hard to get into the NBA and keep a good work ethic and just get better each day because of the message of the movie Rudy. So I, right then and there, I knew the movie was not meant for a football player or an academic. It was meant for a dream. Uh, if you want to go to Notre Dame, you have to work hard. If you want to play football, you have to contribute. You don't have to be the best to be on top. Just be the best you could be and help your other people contribute to them yeah. to be better. Mm -hmm. and, and that's why the movie works. I wonder if you ever, maybe this is a strange question, do you ever tire mm -hmm. of telling your own story, especially since, you know, as you've indicated, it's, it's a lot more complex than gets portrayed in a movie. Well, it is very, there's a lot more that happened. I was in the Navy uh, before Notre Dame uh, because I made that decision. I was uh, working for Commonwealth Edison and the Vietnam War was happening. So I had to make that choice. Well, that's what put my mindset in the right direction was the Navy. Uh, do first things right, the little things right, and you get the big things that will happen for you. And that came loud and clear in the military. So that gave me that mindset to come back from the Navy back to work then my friend dies and I realized life is short you got to move on regardless and and, and don't live in the past and th that's what's interesting about about not living in the past mm -hmm. uh, just move forward and, and and do what you're supposed to do okay good messages there we appreciate your time Rudy's going to be speaking yes. tonight <laughs> Yeah, you're going to be speaking tonight at 7 o'clock at Midwestern University in Downers Grove. It is free and open to the public. You do need to register, though. We're going to have that link on our website at WGNTV.com. Nice to see you, Rudy. We'll talk hey, to you again. Hey, go Chicago. Hopefully. Hey, by the way, we got a Notre Dame guy coaching the Cubs. How about that? This Greg is going to be the year, right? That's all we <laughs> need. This is going to be the year, yeah. <laughs> He's the man. All right, Rudy. Thank all you right, so Rudy, much. We you. appreciate right. your time.